I'm letting him log in. God, I feel like it's been forever. How is everybody? I hope you're doing well, Sarah. Everybody got their jammies on? I feel bad about cutting out of uh, Hadrian's live, but <laughs> you know how that is. Let me know if you can hear me okay. Hey, hey, Pixie. Good. I feel like it's been forever. Everybody doing okay? Hello, Pixie. How are you? So those of you that are new here, mm -hmm. I am Lady Badger. And I sell handbags and accessories. Oh, great. <laughs> so handbags and accessories. So I got some fun things for you tonight. I will show you a few bags that I've chosen. And then, of course, I'll open up the floor and then we'll have a whole lot of fun. Hi, Dee Dee. How are you? Hadrian had some good stuff. I didn't even know. It does feel like forever. It probably was forever. I was going through some things. <laughs> But yeah. Hey, did you guys catch Hadrian's live? Robin, when she gets in here, she bought that Dooney Weekender. I was thinking about it, going back and forth, back and forth. Mm -mm -mm. Do I need it? Do I need it? Do I want it? Do I need it? Do I want it? And I thought, well, I got a million Smiths. Mm. <laughs> I am. I'm in a much better place. I am. Like, I'm going to get all this cut off. All this, ugh. But I'm sweating to death because it's down. <laughs> I was doing this. Do, do I need it? Do I want it? Do I need it? Do I want it? <laughs> yeah, I do not have a Dooney Weekender. Pout, pout, pout. Nice. Nice. Well, hello, DeForte. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Hey, you guys. I'm doing, once again, another massive closet clear out. Because we know that I'm not real huge on selling clothes and shoes and all that anymore. I mean, I will if you guys like the Sauconies and the, um, you know, the good shoes. If I come across that that we all love and new ones, um, I'll grab them. But I started going through a lot of the stock and I'm thinking about popping on tomorrow and doing like a clearance blowout. Everything you see is $12. We're talking sweatshirts, there's some jeans, shoes, coats, everything. Just whoop, popping it out the door. Let me know if you guys are interested in that. I'm telling you, I, you know, the, it, yeah, mm. <laughs> Hi, Sandy D. How are you? I did pull um, a few more bags. A lot of people were coming forward when I said I would cap off the payment plans. Um, I now have an empty shelf again. I did pull some bags. Um, I'm not going to call anybody out. It is what it is. Um, I did pull some of them. Uh, you know, the ones that are, you know, I'm not going to, you know, get payment on, but we're not going to call anybody out. So, oh, Jeremy got in. You finally got it. Okay. Jeremy's here, y'all. So we're going to have some fun. Jeremy made some awesome lemonade. And then of course I'm armed with a monster. I pulled like a gazillion bags. I did have Okay, so a few of you asked me to hold on to some, some doonies um, and hold on to um, Louis Vuittons and things like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you what's available because some people said to, to hold them for them. They were interested. They kind of called it first. 
I'm going to show you when I'm going to let go on those higher end ones and you'll know them when you see them. Um, and then I'm going to let you email me. Um, and then we're going to go through it that way. If we work a deal, that's fine. If we don't, I'll put it up for sale. But I made a few people some promises. So I'm going to show you which ones those are. Um, somebody asked me for a tote, a Claire Vivier. I, I have, I pulled that out. Um, I've got some really vintage Michael Kors going on. Look how, you don't get much more vintage than that. So, there you go. Um, I have made the decision that I am going to work towards moving down with by my bestie in Hobie Sound. So, I'm going to be doing a massive clear out. So, when the, the divorce and that is over... Um, I will be making that transition and I have hundreds and hundreds of bags, ladies, that I need to downsize so that I am not going bankrupt just trying to send them. <laughs> so fun things to come. And don't forget, I'll be there in March. Anybody sees Melanie Stevens, she lives less than two hours away from there. She better come and join us. Okay. <clears throat> Let me show you what I pulled. Hi, Roy Lane, sweetheart. <laughs> Deb, Cindy. I right, said so hi to Sarah. Miss Robin Brown. Love you, girl. Uh, let's see. <gasps> Angela Goodale, did I see you? Angela, hi. <laughs> glad. I'm glad you guys are here. And I would understand if you guys wanted to stick with Hadrian's Live. You know, he popped on. Um, and in fairness, once again, because I completely spaced, I forgot to post it. I know I told everybody I'd be here. I forgot to post it again. I'm going to get better with that. I say I'm going to get better with that, but we all know that, yeah. <laughs> no, I will not move with you. No, not right away. But I'll work on it because I got to have bright, bright clothes. <laughs> I have not. Not yet. Not yet. But I did get a notification on the bronze bag. And I'm still going back and forth. He has a Marc Jacobs collection quilted bag. I don't need another Marc Jacobs collection quilted bag. But that was in beautiful shape. And at $85, I'm drooling. I hope so. It's not going to be immediate, but that, that's going to be the goal. So, when we open up the floor, you guys, don't be afraid to let me know what you would like to see. Um, I've got lots of sunglasses, and I have a lot more littles than I thought I did. Um, hi, Sam. How are you? Um... So let's just get dive right into it, and then, I mean, I'm surrounded now. Okay. So the first one I have, I put a strap on because I didn't have one. I will include it if anybody's interested. Beautiful. I hope, suede looks so horrible on camera, you guys, but this blue. is a beautiful Claire Vivier tote. And it is... Like a dark navy. Almost a purpley. Hi, Marisol. How are you? Just put Claire V. They all know who Claire V is. Bags come and go. How are you? Don, is Hadrian's live over? I hope he didn't cut it short for me. C L A R E. I hope he didn't cut that short for me. <gasps> Melanie, how are you? Melanie, you have like three boxes coming at you, girl. <laughs> I could not find a box in this house big enough for your goodies. <laughs> Hi, Linda. I so I have the Claire Vivier totes. 
And it is gorgeous. It is a big one. Suede scares me. That is the same one that I got from Hadrian. I did get that from him. So you know it's excellente. So somebody was asking for a suede tote. It says 13 tall. And let's see, 15 wide. And six and a half deep. That's a navy, right? Huh? That's a navy blue. Yeah, that's like a dark navy. I will include the strap because it doesn't have one. If you don't like this one, I can find a different one. <laughs> yeah, Robin had a really good video. I got on there. And I sent her, I said, hey, I'm new to your channel. Can I buy the wallet you didn't show? <laughs> so I did. <laughs> so I thought, you know, that was kind of fun. We love our Robin. I did find three straps, guys. So I did find three more. Somebody was asking for straps. Did find three more. So this has a pouch. This is Claire Vivier right there. I don't know why there's a red dot on there. I'm not real sure. I'm going to try. Hello, Bags. I'm here. <laughs> oh, don't be nervous. Don't be nervous. Anybody seen Vicky yet? Hi, Gail. Hi, Jay Sweet. You guys are not going to believe what I did. Oh, the new, um, do you guys know, her screen name is Ed Jin. Ed. And then, of course, Jennifer Yellowhorse. So, Ed gets a hold of me because she bought the Coach Swagger. And I sent Jennifer Yellowhorse the backpack, the Bot Gear backpack. Ed gets a hold of me and she has Jennifer's uh, backpack. Ooh. I know. <laughs> Did you, oh you love I'm glad you love it. Absolutely glad. That took a long time. It's taken a long time. I, they must still be recouping. So if anybody is interested in the Claire Vivier bag, I will include the strap. She's gorgeous. You guys love it when I do this. Here's my head. Here's the bag. But she is beautiful suede. So if you're interested in her, I'm going to let her go for $80. Beautiful, beautiful Claire V. Beautiful Claire V. She's stunning. And I'm surprised she's still stunning because you guys know me and Suede. Holy love of Lord. Suede. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad you love it. Oh, I'm glad you love the Fendi bag. I wanted to touch up like the little trim there around the bottom, but I was afraid to. You know? <laughs> Bags want to show the black vintage Michael Hmm? Bags want to show the black vintage Michael Alrighty. I haven't put it on the list yet. So we're going out of turn. Don't get mad at me. Look at that. You just don't get more vintage than this. It is thick. It has some weight to it. It's very thick leather. Very old school Michael Kors. Look at that. Beautiful condition. <laughs> Mob wife outfit. <laughs> you, <laughs> oh girl. You, it's fantastic. You rock the grandpa, man. You rock it. <laughs> you know, in your honor, in one of, uh, 
the shows I had on uh, my favorite grandpa sweater. It had the what what it's like the velvet thing. I mean, I was sweating in it though. It really, 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 yeah, really the, worked. The white sweater with the leather yeah back, elbow pants. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so inside there we have open pockets on both sides so you got let's see four open pockets and then a zippy it's got the fabric lining very thick and beautiful hey here we go we're gonna pull it out so you don't get more vintage than this <laughs> Look at that. Big old front pocket. So, Jared, he's going to put this a little bit out of turn because I had these numbered. So, put in number 20 for the vintage Michael Kors Extreme Old School 65. Really old school. So let's see. Where... Vintage Michael Kors old school. I would vintage. <laughs> yeah, you know you just don't make them like this anymore. Very thick. You know the leather is comparable to the Pebble Dooney and Burke. It is that thick. Just and it. How much one you say for? Sixty-five. Yeah. There's the handles. So, yeah. Well, I pulled 19 bags and numbered them. <laughs> but that one wasn't on the list. I didn't think anybody, you know, would be interested in um, an extreme Michael Kors, like, Really old school, you know. <laughs> okay. All right. Next, you guys have seen this before. This is a Perlina. Beautiful satchel. I do believe the last time I showed it, I put it up there, out there. I think it was 65 last time. Oh, you're welcome. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. This is beautiful inside and out. If you like Perlina. I got the light really far away. I hope you can see. Love the leather. It has two open pockets and a zippy. Beautiful condition. So last time I showed this, I had it up for 65. I'm gonna let it go today for 55. I'm gonna take $10 off. Hi, Diamond. How are you? The crossbody is not removable, but it is adjustable. Love the detail. The crossbody on it, too. The crossbody. Yeah. Beautiful bag. So we're putting that on sale. <laughs> Loving it. Beautiful Perlina. Beautiful. <laughs> Everybody do anything fun while I was MIA? Adrian! <laughs> what are you doing? You did not cut your life short for me, did you? You better not have. You don't have to do that.
You're bored with work? Work has been amazingly just ridiculous. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, good. Good, good, good. <laughs> Yeah, I couldn't. I couldn't even have a fun day with Vicky because I was at work. I got to work every. I, I, you know, I'm ready to retire. I mean, this is ridiculous. It's, I mean, wow. So the next bag we chose. Don't. This is beautiful Dooney and Burke monogram. I do believe, I showed this last time. I think I showed it for $75 or $80. It's beautiful. Beautiful little bag. Very lightweight. Beautiful canvas material. It looks denim, but it's a canvas. Oh, it might even be a denim. No, I think this is denim. I think it's my first day, and I don't know what I'm looking at. <laughs> you got all your wood? You went to a rage room and broke stuff? Are you kidding me? There's such a thing? Yeah. Can I have one? Can I go to one? You can go I to really one. need to. They, they tell you to go in there and have a blast. Wow! They even give you a room with cards. Well, I don't want to mess up cards. I just want they're, to post my husband's cards. picture on things. Paste it on there and then slam it. Well, we can do that too. <laughs> That's all. Oh, I needed that last week, you guys. I was in just such a angry, dark place and just stressed out of work. And oh, I'm telling you, got the old school, you know, the mace pocket. Here we go. Robin. You know us girls should get together when we're in, when I'm in Florida. Because MS, you're supposed to come and see us. I'm going to see if there's a break room. If I mean, if there's a rage room or whatever. We should do it. There should, there's got to be one in Orlando, right? one in every major city. Oh my goodness. I never heard of it before in my entire life. I'm just not hearing about it. Oh my goodness. We had a rage room. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> the like, yes. Oh, we're doing it. Melanie, we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. So I'm going to put this on sale. I'm going to drop $10 off. I'm going to offer this for 70 It is in brand new condition. Brand new. It is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And these things are expensive. I mean expensive. And that was number three, guys. Hmm? I did, 70. I didn't use it, but... <laughs> oh, yeah. So, you guys, I still have this little zippity dippity, the little case babe. Little zippity dippity. Zipper works good. It's the one that has a little bow on it for the little pull string. This one has two little slip pockets in there. Beautiful condition. Super clean. Yeah. It's a little, I, you know, Kate Spade. A little monogram pouch. Yeah, they are. 
So if you're interested in a little Kate Spade, 35. I'm about ready to take this sweater off so you guys can see the t-shirt of the day. You guys got your jammies on? I got I got Mickey Mouse. Is it 35? Yeah. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I need to grow up. I know. It's not gonna it's not gonna happen. <laughs> I'm sweating. I agree. Oh, I've heard of belt, but I've never seen one. I think the closest thing that we have to that around here is big lots. <laughs> we, don't, we don't have nothing. I'm in Podunk. Podunk, Illinois. Okay. I have another one here for your vegan lovers. I'm going to put this one on sale too. <clears throat> I have this is a Charming Charlie. Beautiful. Can't even tell it's vegan. It's got the, the leather and the suede, the vegan leather and the suede. Perfect condition. <laughs> Country time lemonade mix. <laughs> yeah. What? We don't even have a Ross. I think the closest Ross to me is, they said, what, Decatur, and that's a little over an hour drive? Yeah, yeah, it's an hour and a half drive. Yeah. Well, it's an hour and nine minute drive. Yeah, over an hour drive for me. I, you know, yeah. So the handle on, oh, I don't want to spill anything. Like I said, perfect condition. You can take the strap off and put a fun one on. It has a zippy here. Yeah, this is a charming Charlie. Beautiful interior. Love the studs. I'm all about that. I love the weapon bags that everybody will tell you. It's got a zipper under the flap. That vintage Michael Kors will hurt somebody. <laughs> this has two open pockets and the zippies. Yep. Oh, here we go. So the, huh? Charming Charlie. I spelled Charlie. Char I spelled Charlie. C H A R L I E. Oh, there's many of them. Say, repeat. Here we go. Can you? I don't know. Can you read it? There you go. Yeah. You know, I I don't even have anything like like bins or anything like that close to us. Vicky's gonna take me to the bins. Probably gonna get beat up. <laughs> it's a beautiful interior. I've never put anything in this bag. So I like how it's got a zipper underneath the flappy poo. Beautiful. Close it right up. There you go. So if you were interested in the Charming Charlie, she is only. 45 for a Charming Charlie. Vicky here. Hmm? Vicky just came in. Hey, Vicky. Um, the Vivier tote. The vintage Michael Kors, the big heavy one. Um. <laughs> Dad, hey, Icky. <laughs> <laughs> so we were talking about um i was telling him what you and i talked about this morning vicky about how i'm formulating a plan and i do believe i will be coming to 
will be sound to annoy you for the rest of your life, sister. <laughs> so, <laughs> so yeah. It's heavy, yeah. That was it. Sure, it was a typo. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> yeah. So next one you guys have seen before, and I'm putting this on sale as well. I dropped twenty dollars off this bad boy. What would you do if a YouTube prankster filmed you without you? You know, who cares? Reason being, this day and age, you can't go anywhere or do anything. And even if you do walk into Walmart, it doesn't matter. You could be standing out picking your nose and you don't think there's anybody in the store. You're being filmed. They, they have the whole thing covered. I used to train the loss prevention officers for Walmart and I traveled all over the United States. So with that being said... You're being you're being filmed anyway. I've never been to the bins. I just yeah. So Vicky's gonna take me. Can you guys imagine Vicky and I at the bins? And Melanie, we're making Melanie come to. So this is actually uh, I want to hope I say it right. A via via Spiga. Via. I want to say Spiga. Spiga. Easy. Spiga? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think it's a Spiga. The leather on it is amazing and butter soft. It's a really cool bag. So if you're wanting something really cool, it's very lightweight. So it wouldn't bounce off of somebody's head, you know, and hurt them. You know, yeah, you just annoy them. So it's that lightweight. But I love the intricate decals. So, I've dropped a lot of money off of this. So, if you're interested in the VSPGA, I'm letting her go tonight for $40. And let's have a look at the inside. Let's see if we can pull her guts out. Let's see what happens. $40. $40, yes. $40. Oh, yeah. Last time I showed her, I showed her for $50. We're going to drop it. So we've got a zippy and two open pockets like every other person in the universe. Oh, Vicky's calling it. Vicky, I'm going to wrap up your backpack tonight, too. So if anybody's interested in a big, fuzzy, karami backpack, I have two. Vicky has one. I do have another one. So if anybody's wanting the big, fuzzy backpack for a little girl, I've got one. I saw Annie first. What is going on? Uh, Congrats, bags. Uh oh. Oh. Uh, yep. Bags. To the Vicky, place. bags come and go. Beat you. Uh oh. Annie got you first. I think it's a girl. You're going to love it. Yeah, she did. I scrolled up. She got probably a split second before because I missed it the first time, but I'm also running my mouth, too. Sorry, Vicky. Really? You know, I had never, ever heard of it until I picked it up. But this is a cool purse. It's really cool. I don't think it would be a good weapon bag. But it's <laughs> Maybe if someone That's with my strength cool. behind it, probably. Huh? If someone with my strength behind it, probably. Yeah. Okay. I have... This is like a gunmetal gray, almost black. I have a vintage... Well, I, don't know, I don't think it's vintage. It says long live vintage, so that don't mean nothing. So, but I have a fossil here. 
I'm going to clearance it. I didn't even stuff it because I suck. It's my first day. But it's got the double pockets in the front. I do believe I showed it to you. So I'm going to clearance it. I'm going to do 25 on it. She's beautiful. The leather is great. I know you guys like your fossil. But I didn't put enough stuffing in it. There you go. Dark gray. That don't look yeah, it's like a. Uh, that's not gunmetal gray. It's like a dark grayish, blackish kind of. But the hardware is significant. The key is massive. Beautiful. Beautiful clearance bag. Go ahead and grab her. Twenty-five buckaroonies, and she's all yours. What is it they say? 25 doll hairs. You know, when I first heard people saying that, I thought they were saying dog hair. Like 25 dog hairs. I, I don't know why. It still seems this way. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's just calling it. All right, Vicki, it's all yours. All yours, my love. I do have, I'm clearancing the Rebecca Minkoff. And I will show you why I'm clearancing this. This is like a gray, beige, grayish, more on the gray side. She's in most excellent condition. And the reason why, right there, a little bit of rubbing on the corner. And I haven't been able to lighten that. You guys remember I showed you and I thought, well, I could do something with it. I can't get it to budge. So, this would be something good to paint. The leather is amazing. She's bigger. I did what I could do with her. The strap is adjustable. And it's in beautiful condition. And it comes off. So, you can use that for other purses. You have your front here. You know what? And somebody was asking me for... I found the Valkyrie bag. It is a proper concealed carry. The side, it, it, it has like the stuff in there where you, you put your your firearm into it. It will stay put. Uh, it's a beautiful tote. Um, it zips and then it locks. So I do have a property, property, proper, proper concealed carry bag that somebody asked me for. <sighs> Sweetie. You know what, Jeremy, could you find that where I put that? Where did I put the Valkyrie? I'll, I'll get it. I will grab it for you in a little bit here. Okay, so front pockets. I get distracted by something shiny. All right. All right. I should probably learn how to shoot first. I, I couldn't hit a target standing still. But it'd have to stand very still and not move. And I doubt that would happen, you know. So let's see. Here we go. So here's the inside. We just pull the guts out. Pretty butterflies. Yeah, well, yeah, we'll have to. I'm just not, I'm not a great shot. I mean, I could do... Enough to stay alive. Maybe. <laughs> but. She needs a blunderbuss. I promised somebody that I would try to source one. And I found a. Uh, from Kristen D. I found a really. Really cute one. Was it from Kristen D? No it was not. It'll come to me. Anyway. It might have been the bag lady. Might have been Jamie. It was one of the two. I think it might have been Jamie. So there you go. So she is on clearance for $30. I showed her last time for $45. Dropping her $15. Bucks, $30. You're an awesome shot. I'm not an awesome shot. You'd have to stand 10 feet away from me, right? In front of me. But 
I have a tendency to move a little bit over. And the reason why I, I'm blind in my right eye. So I can't see over here. So I'm finding that I'm, yeah, kind of. Yeah. Well, you know why the world is going crazy? It's probably not a bad idea these days. I'm telling you. So, I had a problem, Miss Joanny, and Vicky. And everybody will tell you right outside my own home, and I swung a bag. I have an IKEA bag. It had you guys' this bags in it. There was probably thirty bags in it, and I swung it at a man's head that was coming at me in between my house, my front porch, and my car. This one? Clearance, Rebecca Minka. So, yeah. I mean, things are crazy these days. You can't even carry pepper spray? What if you get like a pepper spray that looks like a lipstick? It's a taser. Yeah, but you can get pepper spray lipstick, too. And you get taser lipstick. Lipstick taser. Yeah, can you get a taser? Yes. In yeah. Canada? If you do, you have to have a Floyd card. It's considered a concealed carry. <laughs> but you don't need a concealed carry for it. You just need a Floyd card. No, she's talking about Canada. Oh, you just need a, you just need a, it's everywhere. You just need a Floyd card for it. You don't need a concealed carry. $30. Would I get arrested if I sent you one that looked like a lipstick? Yes. <laughs> Would you get arrested? Unless she has a Floyd card, no. Pepper spray and tasers, yeah, but yeah. I need, yeah. Cool, we're going to shoot guns. We're going to go to the bins. Jesus Christ. We're going to drink till we drop during the day with Mel. With, with him in. And, oh, we're going to have a good time. You said $30 for Rebecca, right? I did. I'm going to see you in the news. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, Jeremy's worried he's going to see us in the news, Vicky. So. I'm going to laugh. <laughs> I'm not worried about it. I'm just going to laugh at it. <laughs> really? You, I don't think they'll do that in Illinois. They are so woke here. That's ridiculous. Oh, yeah. Reservation. You take any hey, Jennifer. I was talking a little bit earlier about how I pray to God that that package you got has a coach in there. <laughs> the swagger. The swagger, yeah. I pray. I hope. I pray. I hope. Well, right, you guys, I have a brand new tooled Margot bag crossbody. Beautiful leather. Double zip. Beautiful, Margo. You're not supposed to have... You, you can buy, like, the police sticks and brass knuckles, but you can't use them. Yeah, welcome to Illinois. In Illinois, you can't have them at all. <laughs> but you can go to a swap meet and buy them. Yep, or get them off Amazon or Wish. Or uh -huh. You can buy them. You can't. You can't use them. Oh. Mm mm mm. <laughs> okay. Zippy. Yeah. Mm mm. -mm. I tell you what. Mm mm mm. You see a black spot in the middle of the video? Black or screen. How's that? 
that better? Yeah, I don't see it on the television. How just it goes? <laughs> See, I keep getting distracted. You guys, <laughs> distracting me. Here's the tags. And this retails for $150. I don't know if you can see it. You don't see any spots? Is it better? Yeah, so. The Margo, if you're interested, brand new. She's only $45 tonight, guys. Brand new. Brand new with the tags. Yeah, it's really nice. Really nice bag. My stuffing skills today are something to be desired, I think. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's funny because in my game, I made a creature named Margo. Oh. <laughs> Okay, what's the next clearance bag? So I have a little, little clearance bag, little micro. What the heck is on the front? Of I'll wipe it off. There you go. Now the phone here in the back. My, I have the Note 20. It will slide down in there, but it won't with the case on. So I have to take the case off. This is a little phone wallet, wallet on a chain type deal. It is the strap is removable and adjustable. Just opens up and you got a place for your car slots right there, your bills, whatever you want to put in there. Then on the other side here, you have another little pocket here. Then you got a zippy. And inside the zippy is more card slots. Place for your bills back there. Cute little little Michael Kors phone bag. So this is on sale, twenty bucks. If somebody's interested in something like that, very small. Go. Little small thing. Tiny, tiny. What else we got going on? Okay, so this I pulled. Okay. Well, I need a pencil. Here we go. Jennifer, it's all yours. Okay, so I did pull this bag. You guys remember this one? It's a red fossil. You know, it's like, yeah, it is more like an ox blood, isn't it? You know, it's a little lighter than ox blood. It's showing up true on camera. You've got the suede details on top. has a beautiful tassel here. Crossbody is adjustable, but it's not removable. You got your key. Beautiful bag. Beautiful leather. Has a little back pocket for your phone. Your phone slide right down in there. Beautiful. So this one was pulled off a layaway. So this is one of them. We have a big open pocket. There you go. I should move that right a little bit more in front of me, I think. Maybe I'll quit, you know. Having to lean over. Here we go. Dust bunnies are free from the paper. Yeah. The pocket. Being asked for taking all the vouchers to the porta. Um, the the little terrier will stay with Jeremy. Um, I will be taking Ziggy Dog. Um, depends on Matilda. Yeah, 
probably yeah, Matilda and Ziggy. Now I'm not sure about Sarah. Um, she's really likes Brian, so I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sure, but you know, Ziggy Dog and Matilda will go for her. If not, I'll take Sarah as well. Yeah. So Sarah's you know, she's all about Bri Bri. She's in the land with him right now. Yeah, she's in there sleeping with him right now, you know. So she doesn't just sleep with him, she sleeps right on top of a man face to face. Oh, I'm glad. I'm glad you love it. So, yeah, it's taking a long time. So, like I said, this come off a layaway. So, if you're interested in the fossil, I will let it go for what I put it on layaway for. It's $50. Five zero. Beautiful fossil. Robin, you would like that? Gotcha. Now, is anybody looking for a giant pink tote? I mean, big. Big, big. Big tote. Big, big. I'm putting her on sale. Yep, I think that one's next. Yep. And I'm taking twenty dollars off of it from the last time I showed it. Okay, yep. Oh, there goes that backpack. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the size of this mama. Not the size of my belly, but the part. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous, smooth leather Kate Spade. She is a monster. She is big. But she's very lightweight. You want to save it for tote bag Tuesday? You want to save it for tote bag Tuesday? <laughs> I already put it on the list. But it'll show up on tote bag Tuesday, guys. Yeah, she is pretty in pink. Is that tomorrow? Tote bag Tuesday? Well, tomorrow Tuesday, so I think so. Is that the right day? I don't want to get in trouble by not being somewhere. <laughs> so she has a zip closure. Gold tone hardware. Vicky said yes. Okay, I'm just making sure. Oh, grief, man. So it's got a big old zipper pocket and two open pockets. They form to make your purse. <laughs> True that. Okay. So this bad boy is 12. Bottom is 12 at, or 13 at the bottom. And across the top, it is a massive 18. And then it is five depth. So. Beautiful Kate Spade. So, if you're interested, she is on sale for 75 Yeah, you guys, join us tomorrow for Tote Bag Tuesday. It's your happy place. It's an extra large pink Kate's pink coat. 75. MS is calling it. 
You're going to love this. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It is cool. And I do have a really fun Rebecca Minkoff. Not looking like you would think it was. Look at this. She is beautiful satchel. Her feet she's got a little bit of wear, but that is it. Rebecca Minkoff. This is a Rebecca Minkoff. The strap is removable and adjustable. Love the studded details. I would say this is lightweight to medium weight because it has a potential to be heavier. Beautiful, Rebecca. Okay, let's see if we can pull the guts out. No, of course it won't let me. Okay, so we have a zipper pocket, two open pockets, like every other bag in the universe. There you go. Beautiful. So it has actually one, two, it actually has four open pockets. Then you got your Rebecca Minkoff right here. There you go. I love the satchel style. If you guys haven't figured that out, if it's not a giant toad or giant dooney, it's a satchel. Anyway. <laughs> Just... I don't know. I tend to gravitate towards so I try not to. But, you know. We don't have, you know, purse vaccinations. They're not addictions. I don't call it addiction. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so if you're interested in the black from Rebecca Minkoff satchel, she is 65 today. 65. Beautiful by the mother. It's gorgeous. I'm getting quite a pile here. And you guys seen seen this backpack, and I had some interest in it, so I'm going to show it to you again. It's a Vera Bradley. It showed up in a box of goodies that I bought. It was a freebie. So, because I, yeah, I'm not a Vera Bradley fan, by no means. But here it is. It is rock and roll cool, isn't it? Beautiful. Love it. So this is very soft. The quilty fabric. You can use it as a backpack. You can use it as a sling. Can't use it to hit anybody. It just bounce right off of them. There you go. Huh? Put a brick in it. Huh? Put a brick in it. I'll put, yeah, put a brick in it. <laughs> there you go. With the floral design. Yeah. So. It's very hippie. You know, it's, it's 25 if somebody wants it. We'll give it a clearance price. That would probably cost nothing to ship. 25. Yeah. No, I don't think you need a fish up in bite. I mean, oh, it has this little thing in here. It's a I'm thing. Not, are they talking about the Discord? Yeah. You, did you send me the invite to that? Yeah. We just saw, as long as someone's in it, it's, it's all fine, man. Yeah. We can go in and just copy the um, the link. To invite, because I sent it to Jeremy. That's how he got in. So anybody can do that. If you email me or whatever, remind me. Because you, girl, you know I'll forget. Remind me, and I will send you the link. Not a big deal. Because girl, we would love to have you. I haven't even had a chance 
You know, people will send me messages and they'll say something. And then I don't get the message like six days later because I'm just horrible about popping in there. Quilted. Bear Bradley. 25. Or that's going to show up in one of y'all's boxes. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm not taking that with me, man. So, <laughs> just, just not. I'm, that's how much I am not a Vera Bradley fan. I'm sorry to say that. It's cute. Sure. It is. But it's not my cup of tea. Okay, you guys are going to love this. Dee Dee, are you watching? Beautiful. Dooney and Burt denim. <sighs> Did I show this before and I forgot to clean that off? Yep. I'm going to clean that off. God, rookie. There you go. Denim. I know you're doing some kind of feature denim. I'm, I'm watching. There you go. That's a piece of paper. Get out. There we go. So. So if anybody's interested in the denim Dooney, I will wipe it off. I said that last time too. I'm going <laughs> to... I've dropped $5 off of it. I will offer this for $40. Beautiful leather. She is gorgeous. You glad you waited? Katie, if you're interested in the Vera Bradley, you know, I'll give you a good deal on it. Dee Dee Bean is calling this. Girl, I will. <laughs> I promise I'll wipe it off before I send it to you. I promise. Promise, promise. So I have some higher end things. I still have the Bulgari. I still have the Gucci wallet. There is a Gucci wallet. I keep getting emails on it. Now, the Gucci wallet, I, have, I still have the other one. I don't, I do have this one still. This I'm putting on sale for 90. I showed it last time. I do believe for what was it, 135 or 125. So, but I mean, it's the foiling is starting to fade a little bit. Hi, guitar professionals. How are you? The wallet is still in just amazing shape. Hmm? This is like a, it's like a purpley, purpley color. What's Gucci? It is a brand of this wallet. Well, I'm glad you're doing well. I'm doing much better, too. So you have your card slots here. You have more card slots there. It's got a little bit of wear on it, guys. So like I said, I'm offering it for 90 You know, this would be a fun one to paint. I mean, you would lose a gold foiling or whatever, but... So, there you go. Well, he's gone now. So, if you guys say troll, we make him go away. But, you know, haters will be haters. <clears throat> so, I did get a, I did get a, a shocker. Hi. I did get a shocker. I was watching a sneak peek of another YouTuber. And they had a purse similar to my beloved 
Dooney. I almost fell over. So. So she is on sale for 90 if you are interested. The same thing for the Bulgari. I'm going to put that on sale for 90 as well. What's going on? Did I miss it? Hi, Artist Style. Yeah, I did remove somebody a minute ago. But they're always going to be there. Yeah, this is a handbag channel. But thanks for checking it out. Thank you. So this is beautiful Bulgari. There you go. Area in there. Super clean and gorgeous. Beautiful condition. So she is 90. Hmm? They are beautiful. So these are on sale. If anybody's interested, no worries at all. Ooh, what are you guys up to? Going to the Discord. Um, if Jeremy decides to come with me, yes. If he doesn't, no. You can. Yes, ma'am, Dee Dee, you can. Okay. Was that number 17? Hmm? Yeah, the Bulgari wallet was 17. The gray Gucci wallet was 16. That's the plan. Semi-retire. Vicky and I are going to start a business together. We're going to join forces. We're going to open a storefront. B-U-L-G-A-R-I. You want to go with the snake? B U L G A R I. The girls understand what you're saying. <laughs> That's okay. How much do you want for? 90. 90 as well? Yeah, both the wallets are 90. It's going to be super fun. I, I, I think that the stress and everything going on here, I think that was kind of uh, uh, the deciding factor. Um, kind of pushed me over the edge. I pulled another bag out of Layaway. I don't know if you guys remember this. I will include the strap if you're interested. This is a denim Talbot's bag. And it is amazing. I don't think... It's ever been used. I'm sure Talbot's is not everybody's favorite, but this bag, I couldn't leave it because it was gorgeous. Got the belted detail, the beautiful denim, zip top closure. The gorgeous bag. It has an open pocket and a zipper pocket. Am I here? Yeah, 
everyone else is here and they see you. It's just, she got, she lost you for a split second. Oh, she did? Everybody else is okay? Yeah. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, it's kind of a medium size. It's not, to me, it's small. So, to you, it would be medium size to the rest of the normal world. <laughs> Very lightweight. Beautiful. It is a Talbot's. Let's see. Let me make sure. The uh, trim. Yeah, so this is, the you know, denim. And then the trim is cow leather. And then the liner inside is... is the fabric is polyester, it says. So we got cow leather and denim. Can't go wrong with that. And so this is back up for sale, and I'm dropping it to $40. <laughs> Do you refresh? I need a refresh. You have a copy right there. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> Marisol's calling it. You're going to love it, Marisol. Ah, uh, Marisol beat you guys. I wonder if this... Okay, so it's a cool detail. I mean, this unbuckles, you can move it, but it does nothing. <laughs> so I don't know why you'd mess with that, but you know. yeah, this bag is amazing. There you go. So that was one that was pulled off a layaway. Bag is saying, do not forget to show the the toe with the concealed carry pocket. Hmm. I would have, too. I absolutely would have. Sorry. Okay. Number 19. All right. That is not a bag. That is a pouch. Okay. All right. Next thing I pulled off. I won't. I'm sure if you watch these other resellers, you know who I got it from. God, I'm pretty sure it was Jamie White Knight. I'm almost positive. So this is back off a of layaway. This is a beautiful, this is a large Kate Spade pouch. In the black and like a, yeah. This one has, if you put your hand in there, you can, feel where a gun's supposed to go and all that. I don't know. I didn't research it or anything. I just grabbed it. It was offered a good deal. Uh, and I grabbed it because somebody asked me to try to source one. And it looks cool. It looks badass. And I need to get it. So. so it's a beautiful blush pink and black. And it has. Thank you. Big zippy. So that's what it's got in there. It's a real soft leather. So if you're interested in the big old zippy, she is what I could put oh forty dollars. It is a cute wristlet. She's a big wristlet. So I just thought she was beautiful. She looks brand new. I've never used her. As soon as I got it, it sold. And then, well, we know. The rest is history. <clears throat> the last bag before I open up. Where nope, that was it, huh? We already showed 20, let's say. I'm sorry? We already showed number 20 already. Yeah. So number 20 is the vintage uh, Michael Kors that you guys seen earlier. So, I do have bags back here. Um, open up the floor. Like, I did pull this out of layaway. If anybody's interested in a Michael Kors satchel. 
this beauty, this beautiful microcores. And you already seen the petition ass flap, and then that's a hair on it. This is brand new with tags. Little Patricia Nash. I'm spitting it out. So those. And then I'm going to open up the floor. So if you guys want, you can say hi to chat with Jeremy for a second. And this is the company Failure LePage. Oh, never heard of it. Never heard of it. But I'll let you guys chat with Jeremy for a minute, and I'm going to go get the Valkyrie, the that one, for bags. And I will be right back. I think I stuck it right inside the purse room. Where did I put that? Fiore the page is what that bag is called. You misspelled. <laughs> the Valkyrie? No, the 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 Fiore the page. Okay. Grab that. I'm go potty too when I go. Oh, they didn't hear that, did they? <laughs> they probably did. Okay. Found it. I found it. I found it. <laughs> Let me stuff it up. This bag is super cool. 7 p.m. Eastern, 6 p.m. Central. Because Vicky's an hour ahead of me. So, I'm running out of stuff. Let's see. There we go. Nope. I don't know. Check this out. It's got a zipper pocket in the back. So this is called a Valkyrie. There we go. So, I did not do any research on it. <laughs> I got it for an amazing deal, so I'll give it for an amazing deal. So, I don't see any fabric tag, so I am going to assume that it is probably, that's not leather. I'm assuming that is vegan leather. But it is thick. It's heavy. Well, it's not a heavy bag, but I mean, it's, you know what I mean? It's very high quality. So you got two slip pockets there, a zipper, another zipper. It does come with a brand new strap. I do believe this purse is brand new. I don't have the tags. I don't think it's ever been used. Very nice. So, down inside, there is a key. So, right here, 
the wrong zip. Nope, that's the right one. See that? There's a little lock. This opens up. See down, you see that down in there? Place for your firearm to hold it in place. So the bag will zip up. Put the key in, give it a half a turn, and it locks. Stick your thumbnail in the leather. If it bounces back, it's not leather. All right, let's do. Okay. Well, it didn't. It didn't bounce back. It's still. It bounced back a little bit. I don't, I don't think it is. It's not, I don't, I'm going to say it's not, I'm going to say it's vegan leather, but it's super high quality and beautiful. I wouldn't steer you around. It's very nice. So, if you're interested in the concealed carry bag, I will offer it for $50, five zero. Like I said, I got an amazing deal on it. I will pass it on. Yeah. But it does lock. It does come with a crossbody. It does have the stuff in there to hold a firearm in place. Hmm? Uh, V-A-L-K-R-I. I like it. I think it looks bad out. <laughs> I like it. Handbag or a purse? It's a purse. All right, ladies. Now that I am surrounded. The price you said how much? 50 5 -0. Yeah, it's neat looking. So, I am opening up the floor. So, holler out what you would like to see. Don't don't holler out too many tote bags, I guess, because that's for tomorrow. Do I have totes? Vicky actually asked me that. Do I have totes? That is so funny. Hi, Miss Ed. Jennifer Yellow Horse is here. We were talking. Oh, <laughs> uh, Jennifer, Miss Ed Jen here, Miss Edna. She's the one that has your backpack. I'm so sorry, you guys. I'm so sorry. I was in such, oh, uh, such a bad place. Roylene, I have. I have the green embroidered. I have this beautiful sage. It's like a gray sage and tan. And I have, I have that in brown. And if I look, I could probably find a few more, but these are the embroidered ones. I do have, And I do have, oh, somebody called that. You can't have that strap. That comes with that bag. I'll get in trouble by Marisol. And I probably do have a few more around here. See it? She's going to check her mail tomorrow, Miss Edna. So... All right. 
here we go. They're going to start. There you go. Tick, tick, tick. <laughs> you want the green one? You can. The embroidered ones, these ones, these are the thinner ones. These are 15. So. Looking for one that will go with black. The MK bag behind me. Ooh, there, that one. This one is a beautiful satchel. We'll mark this one as number 21. Two. 22. 22? Oh, yes, a Valkyrie. I forgot about that. I didn't write that down. It's a beautiful Michael Kors. Nice soft leather. Here's her feetsies. The strap is removable and adjustable. Love the detail. Cool chain ring. So she has three compartments. He, is it a he? If it's a Michael Kors, could be a he. I think it's a he. So this front compartment has two open pockets. Love the leather. Beautiful. Gold tone hardware. The other side has two more open pockets and your zippy. And it has a little key fob down in there. Here's the tag. And then we have a zippy right in the middle. A gorgeous, gorgeous bag. I've never used it. It's been kind of sitting there. I thought it was sold, but it wasn't. So this bag sold for $95. I will offer it tonight for $85. I will take $10 off. Hi, Karen. <laughs> Beautiful. Love the leather on this. It is so thick and it is so nice. Love it. Beautifully made bag. Hi, Cynthia. How are you? <laughs> Beautiful. I pulled this out. I'm not sure if any of y'all would be interested in this. This is pretty loud, but it's a beautiful satchel. I like my jacquard stuff. You guys know that. Mm-hmm. Mon jacquard monogram. White leather. Well, it's more like a cream. Beautiful bag. Jacquard, yeah. J A Q U A R D. You 
you want me to go see for those traps? Yeah. Jeremy's gonna go see if there's more straps, guys. <laughs> two open pockets on one side, two more open pockets on the other side, and a big zippy. It's a nice bag. Yeah, how is he? It looks like, um, looks like we have some pen marks that I missed. But I reckon I can get those out if somebody's interested in this bag. Now, I sold this originally for $65. i am going to drop it to $50 if somebody's interested. And I will pull the liner out. And get rid of those pen marks. So Jeremy went to go look for strappies. So we'll call that number 23, the monogram satchel. Okay, MS, it's all yours. It's a cute bag. Holy Lord, he found a bunch more. <laughs> so MS called it the MK Monogram Satchel for 50. Okay. And then put a, um, let me put a side note here, pen marks, because I'll forget, and then I'll turn around and send her, send her bag. All right, I put a note on there. Yeah, this is nice. It's old school. It's cool. But this has been sitting on the shelf since, probably since I moved in here. It's been there for a long time. And the lady that asked about what would go with black, that black one would probably go with black. She was okay, so you were looking for a black strap. Oh, Roylene? Is she still here, Roylene? Something that will go with black. Well, I got some fun stuff. I have this one. And then I do have... We have pink. We have... Oh, here we go. The black and pink. There you go. And these are the big, thick, embroidered ones. So these ones, the big, thick, embroidered ones are 20. Um, and then I have the other one. So this is what we have left. So this is what I've got, and they're embroidered, and they're very nice. Black and pink, please, you can, obviously. Let me write it down. Like so, black and pink strip. Mm-hmm. You don't have to put the straps in there. I'm not. Oh, okay. <laughs> you strictly do this for just the purses and whatever. Yeah. We got your strappies. Do you love the accent? Mm. So is anybody interested in the little Patricia Nash? Angela wants to see the one in the package. The strap. The lot one. This one? Oh, let me take here. Yeah, here. Yeah, I'll take it package. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to see it through a plastic? 
This one's fun. Very hippie. Love it. Very cool. Yeah. Well, guess. The first person show please. The little doggy is snoring. That's the the little the little Boston Terrier making that big old noise out her face. <laughs> now she's asking what's the first person. Uh, Angela says mine of us. Oh, the first purse that I showed? The very, very first one? Oh, you were wanting to see the... I moved it. The Claire Vivier? Angela's calling this I know. the hippie strap. Ooh. I yelled at you for a second. Did you? Yep. Oh, good green. <clears throat> I gotcha. Okay. And I have a strap on that, which I will include. It's a dark navy Claire Vivier. You're a jerk. Get GP. Is this a card reading or silly shit? Is it a what? Is this a card reader slash it's like DEP? Let me get rid of it. Get to the block party. No, that's Annie. Why would you want to get rid of that? DTP's Annie. Well, they're saying something about it. Oh. DTP, is this a card reading or selling shit? Well, you know. Nope, I'm going to keep it G rated. Okay. I was going to say, I had it ready to go, but you just tell me yes or no. <laughs> Here we go. She said, what did I do? It, it doesn't matter. What did I do? Yeah, okay. We got her. Okay. There we go. Beautiful suede. Is that bag number one? This is bag number one, the Claire Vivier. Suede looks so horrible on camera. This is a beautiful, beautiful suede bag. The leather is amazing. There's the inside. It's Claire V right here. She has a little dot on her. I don't know why. There's the Claire V. This is a beautiful thick leather suede. Yeah, I, I deleted them. I pushed them out. Is there another one? No. Oh, okay. You sure can. So if anybody, if you're interested in this, I will include the strap because I didn't come with a strap. So we can put a strap on there, but it's a, like a, it's a dark navy. Dark, dark navy. She's little bitty. <laughs> you're welcome, Roiling. Her little, little baby. Angela and Gail are talking about Yeah. So I haven't even taken the packaging out of there. She retails for $129. I will do $55 on her. If you're interested. Brand spanking new. Never, yeah, she's got a... Her crossbody does come off if you want to carry her as a clutch. And I do believe... Let's, here we go. On the other side, we got card slots. Then you have a zippy. Those are her tags. I put the tags in there so I didn't lose them. There we go. Got a sunflower. Huh? Got a sunflower. Sunflower? 
Marigolds. Marigold Harvest. Here's your authenticity card. Angela's calling it. It's beautiful. Let me put the stuffing right back where I found it. Let's see here. I do believe I have. All right, Miss Angela. It's very pretty. So we'll call that one what? Number 24? Okay. Well, it's gonna be super cold. The icy tomorrow. Huh? It's gonna be super cold tonight. The icy tomorrow. It's gonna be icy. Oh, it's raining outside right now. It's raining. Oh, great! It's supposed to get down to like what? Ten degrees, and it's raining. There you go. I've got her in a bag already. Those little ones don't come with dust bags, so we've got her in a little bag. She's all yours. So, do you guys want to see the bags that I'm going to let go of? You guys are going to die. Look at this. This quote is amazing. This will show up tomorrow. Maybe I'll do a special prize on it. <laughs> a tote bag. I don't know. What are you saying? Yes, show old totes. Hmm? They're all saying yes, please show me those. Oh, Angela, you love Patricia? Girl. Oh, girl. So for the bag you're showing, but they, they... I still have the flat bag. She's on sale for 50. Girl, I got Patricia. I will gather those bags for you guys, no problem. There you go. Like I said, a couple of people made me promise. But I'm going to show you. And the fun part will be... They'll need to get a hold of me. Before the tote sale. And then maybe we'll... So, Angela, let me know if you're interested in this. So, because this is 50. I've had it for a while. She's in amazing condition. She's on sale for 50. So. All right. Let me move this mountain. Okay. Pop bags, you're letting go of the Y. Well, because I'm trying to downsize. All right, I have a lot of bags that I use for my business, that I have for my business, but I also have bags from my personal collection that is almost as large as um, my, my business purses. I need a room dedicated, and T Vicky and I were talking about this morning, I need a room dedicated to just my collection. Um, I don't need that many. Do I really need four Louis Vuittons? Do I really need four Dooney and Burke Smiths? Yes, I do. Don't even... Remember that I said that about the Doonies, but do I need? Um, <laughs> uh, I even scored a new Louis Vuitton canvas bag. Um, I have started getting smaller bags, but I have a lot of Kate Spade. I've got um, a quite. A, I'm getting quite a bit of Fendi. I have. The Tory Birch. Do I mean am I uh, I have my go to's like I have certain Doonies, my Mulberry, um 
I have ones that I gravitate to. Um, but then I have some that are, that I don't gravitate to. The birthday bag has returned, my loves. Um, it's in the thumbnail. I have mine in the other room. I now have the other one. Um, we did some trading. Yeah. But, yeah. Well, you guys have seen my studio. My personal collection has now pushed out. That's my personal collection in there now. Um, and I'm overwhelmed. Luxury and contemporary. So, it, it, yeah, it is hard. But, do I, you know, moving forward, I want to make changes, if that makes any sense. You know, maybe I'm going through a men's version of a midlife crisis or whatever. I, I have, hmm, I don't know, but I just decided that, you know, these are bags that I'm not using, I'm not gravitating towards. I don't know why I'm holding on to them. Um, it's just a few. It is hard. I'm the same way. I'm the same way. So I will pull a, a couple of them. Um, yeah. So. Awesome bag. If that don't sell, I won't be upset. <laughs> All right, you guys, give me a second. I will surprise you with what I'm going to let go. But, I mean, bear in mind, letting go, for me, there's like six or seven that I'm going to let go. And there's only 150 more. So. Yeah. I will. There's a, a lot of people um, that told me, do not, blah, blah, you know, let me know. So I'm, I'm just throwing it out there. Um, I made the decision. I made a lot of decisions. Like, ah, uh, I'm going to retire. Yeah, I'm going through that. And I've decided that, yeah, I'm going to... You know, I'm mid fifties. I'm I'm gonna live for I'm gonna live for me. Now it's time. Oh, good. I just Smith and Wesson. <laughs> yeah. Speaking of Dooney, they had a sale. It's right here. Now, one of them belongs to uh, Robin. But I, I was able to get my hands on a couple more. You guys are going to die. DDB. So, one of these are Robin's. Uh, I now have a few of these. Look at the Dooney and Burke charm. And it's heavy. Heavy. <laughs> awesome. Still got the tags on it. So, I found these. They were having their sale. So, yeah. So, yeah, they're, they're a tiny bit pricey. We're trying to pass the cars. Hmm? We're 
Yeah. They are cute. Thought you would appreciate that. I do have two, two spares. So if you guys want them, they're gonna they're $35 each. I think their retail price on those D are they're they're like 60 bucks, aren't they? 50 or 60 bucks. Yes, I only have two, so Don grabbed Don grabbed one. Pauline's in Pauline Paris. Okay, sorry guys. These are like sixty bucks. I got them on the sale. I'm not trying to make a ton of money off of them here. So, so I'll see if I can. See if I can grab some more. Thirty-five. Okay. Let me on. Was a red laser? What? Okay. I'm like, what? <laughs> oh, I'm live. Hey, you guys, I'm live. Donna Thomas. They both said it. Don said the same thing. Don and Pauline. Donna can have the Pauline thing. Oh, okay. Okay. Donna Thomas. All right. That's very nice of you, um, Pauline. Okay. There you go. Okay. So, if I can grab, because I think they were on sale for like 29 and then by the time I paid the shipping and that, they come to about 35 I'm not looking to make any money on them. I just found them. So, if they're still on sale, I will grab more and get them because they're cool. So, there you go. So this one is, uh, there's three in there. That one belongs to Robin Brown. Aren't those neat? All right. So Don got one. Donna Thomas has one. And Robin already has, is having hers. And I'm going to grab those bags. So say hi to Jeremy, and I will show you the surprise bags. It should be Donna and Don. Yeah, Donna and Don. Yeah. Those are really cool. Yeah, well, give them out of the fridge. these. All right, there's three. Okay.
four, and then this one is five. Okay, this would be all my brain can take. Okay. <laughs> this we... We're going to freak out. <laughs> Probably. Okay. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Are you guys ready? Special bag time. We're talking about revolvers. <laughs> revolvers? You guys want to... I don't have any guns for sale. <laughs> you can't do that in the first place. <laughs> I want to add a Wow. Okay. <laughs> Any guns real in the in the right imagination? Beautiful case, babe. It is. I picked this up from Hadrian. I thought I would use it. I still love it, but I'm not using it. Look at that. She's beautiful, personified. It is. Look, it is mint still has the cards and all the, the stuff to go with it i think he said nobody he doesn't look think anybody's ever used it it's absolutely mint yep this is green it's like a beautiful hunter green it is fancy it is gorgeous the strap is adjustable, but it's not removable. Love the big back pocket. So, I paid a fair bit to Hadrian for this bag. <laughs> yeah, that would have been cool. I mean, you could put a little pea shooter in there. Throw the pea shooter in there. Or the old 22 pen gun. Yeah. <laughs> but she is gorgeous. Not using her. So, if anybody is interested, I think I paid, what did I pay Hadrian for this one? I think I paid $135 for this bag. I will let it go for what I paid for it. I'm not looking to make... She just needs a home. She's not being used. She's just kind of hanging around. It is beautiful. I'm holding a pencil, not an ink pen. So this will be number 25. So, I'd be confident in the saying that she's new without tags. She has her paperwork, but there's no tags on there. Green crossbody. We'll do 125 on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's why I paid Hadrian for it. Yeah. So 
So there's that one. I do have, if anybody is interested in the big accordion style Tory Burch, I have that one. Okay. All right, ladies. This one. Still working on her handles, but she's much lighter. Yeah. Yes, ma'am. She is pretty now. She does, like I showed before, I did stop the damage, but the little stress fracture there. Handbag. I just put Louis Vuitton handbag. It's the only Louis Vuitton I'm showing. The stress there, but it's not going anywhere. The Travoli. I forgot. <laughs> so, she is, the canvas is pristine. So, I've been super busy. The handles have not had, look at them. They've not had a treatment in about two weeks, but I will continue to treat it. So I promised that I would let you guys know when I was ready to let her go. I will um, continue to treat. I've almost got them. See, I got one that's better than the other. So you can tell this one got the treatment last. So it is coming up beautifully. Yep, yeah, it is. So, you'll have to shoot the email on that one. All right. Email for price. So, let's see. Let me show the inside. Look how pretty. Inside is beautiful. There you go. Invite Marcos to block party. Oh. Okay, I got it. My brain. There we go. It is pristine. Absolutely. She's a beauty. So. A lot, a lot, a lot. When I got this bag, it was a hot mess. Take, it took me weeks to get her where she's at. She is a labor of love, was a labor of love. Is it MM or PM? That's, this, is, this, would be, this is a bigger bag, you guys. Um, it's not, it's not a PM, it's not a, it's not a, I don't know. She's a bigger bag. The Jerry's. <laughs> Let me. Okay, so give you kind of an idea. She is 11 and a half inches tall and 18 inches wide and 8 inch depth. She's not a small bag. Let's do the head check. There we go. This is the bag. This is my head. <laughs> Somebody put email 
<laughs> so there she is. Yeah. She's a big girl. Yep, I did the head check. <laughs> yeah, she's she's not the small one. What is the big one? GM? I think so. It's a grande model. She's very, very lightweight, but she she's a bigger bag. She a vegan. Vegan, vegan, vegan. What is the next one? The next one is the Fendi. Canvas Fendi. She is extremely lightweight. Beautiful. Smaller straps. Mm -hmm. There's her corners. I should let you do the head check because you're bigger. <laughs> Me? Yeah, so the bag looks smaller. No, I mean something like that. I mean, that's a bigger bag. You don't you don't wanna be surprised. You get a bag that's just too big for you. I gotcha. I had the clearance for Becca Minkoff. Um, hmm. I don't think so. I didn't have a whole lot of hobos tonight. Pristine badger bag. It's a beautiful bag. Beautiful. Because the weather's been so bad, I'm still, I'm still in my uh, the Kate Spade um, that I can fall down on my butt on the ice with. Yeah. Hmm. Yes. Yeah, look at me with a Fendi. I try to be fancy and bougie. <laughs> so there you go. Beautiful. I'm still attached to the other Fendi. This one. Next bag is... You guys have seen this one. What do you want the price of that? To email me. Email you. Yeah, those those are the two of the bags that people said they wanted to talk to me first. So I'm going to be fair. For a lot of you, I wouldn't know. Vicky might know. She might know. Beautiful Dooney. Dooney Smith. Mm -hmm. You guys have seen this one a few times. Oh, the costume. You know, I try watching him. Um, but I, I'm not into costume jewelry. I mean, I would be. But with my nickel allergy, you know, it's, it's just not, it's just not worth it. Yeah, it's like a brown. 
So, yeah. He gets some, some funky pieces, I, you know. The Red Wine Alley. He goes to something called the Red Wine Blue Thrift. He hits, um, there's some auction house that he goes to all the time and he finds a lot of good stuff. Um, yeah. And there's another, there's a consignment place that he goes to. Yeah, I'd have to look at his videos. So I got a strap on this because if anybody knows about the leather Dooney Smiths, you need a crossbody strap. <laughs> so the Dooney Smith. Somebody was asking about that. And the last one. Mostly you know for Yeah. up there you have to go often and early you know game by shorts <laughs> I watched him the other night but he wasn't doing purses or anything he was cooking or something he was doing something in his house so This is ox blood. That is ox blood. Ox blood is red. Hi, Veronica. Robin. It's the birthday bag. Ox blood is red. This says the extra large ox blood. Oh, I guess I put coach. Dreamer. It is a big one. It has an ox blood. It's got brass hardware, the brass tone hardware. It's got the rivets, like, no, not rivets, but those studs. But inside here, this is suede. So it's got the suede. Oh, I will. I'm taking my yearly bonus from work just so that I could thrift. That's a lot. So coming back with an entire car of turf up here. <laughs> <laughs> so it's this. So excellent. Place for crossbody. She is a big one. You got a big open pocket here. And then on the other side, another open pocket. So you got pocket on each side. Yeah, she's going to take me to Palm Beach. I'm just excited about the bins. I want to see the frenzy. I want to see what the hype is all about. I want to see the fighting and the yelling and the screaming. And I want to see it all. I want to experience it. With the strap. Hmm? I still think it's ox blood. I've seen ox blood that's like red. That's ox blood. This is ox blood. And it's purple. This is ox blood. Okay. <laughs> there you go. That's coach down in there. You have your creed right there. This is three one zero two zero. Night bags. Hmm? Oh, night, Annie. Have a great night, honey. She's got big, thick leather. She even has the rivets on the inside. I have, would be twinsies. I have the exact same bag in the other room. There's your coach. 
tag, spinning tag. Beautiful dreamer. That via speaker, that's a cool bag, man. And the leather on is great. You're going to be happy with that. That's cool. They can try. But I mean, you guys have all met Vicky, right? They don't call me Badger for nothing. Yeah. They can try it. Yeah, you get out of my mom's bed, that makes me mm. look like a nice person. <laughs> I can be mean. I earned my nickname. That's an understatement. <laughs> oh, you saw it happen to CJ? Oh, Lord. Well, he's a really nice guy, too, though. But, I mean, I'm there to experience it. You know, it depends on what they want to take out of my my cart. I mean, do you really, if you really need it that bad, then take it. But. So what kind of news was he uh, a mug shot of you for punching someone's wife up when you're in Florida? <laughs> All right, got it. I'm, no, I'm going to have fun. I'm not going there to get in trouble with the law. <laughs> Or if I take somebody your car, you'll get in trouble. <laughs> I know you. That's all right. I'm not worried about it at all. Uh -huh. Isn't this the prettiest coach ever? I, I have this. The Dreamer is probably not for everybody. I have this, I don't know, fascination with the Dreamers. They are my favorite coach bag. They are. The leather on that's amazing. It is so thick. And it's got the... The, you know, the pebbled leather. It's very reminiscent of Alexander Wang over here. Can I open it up? Sure, I can open it back up. No problem, sweet. Girl, we could be twinsies. I got the exact same bag in the other room. I had such separation anxiety when I got rid of the first one. <laughs> yep. So, there you go. There's the strap. What was it say? Where did I already lose the strap? Vicky gets that bag. It'd be called Dreamer Mama's. Yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful bag. So, there's a couple on eBay. Um, they run about anywhere from $275 to $399. I've seen one for $469, and they were not in as good a condition as this. So, <laughs> so it's three hunch, honey. But worth every single penny. Yeah. Extra large. Did I put the strap back in there? I lose straps. Okay. If you want it, baby girl. Absolutely worth it. They are ridiculously expensive. That's for sure. It's beautiful. I don't need to. I do have the blue dreamer or the little black dreamer. It's a box, he said. It's this style. It's there. 
love that bag. I love that bag more than I love this bag. That tells you anything. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, the queen. Mm -hmm. The queen. <laughs> Okay, Vicky, it is yours. She, she never said, uh, I, does she always go by, I want it? Mm hmm. Hey, there's a vanilla eating milk. Okay, I removed. Maybe they said something nice, but I doubt it. You know how the trolls are. <laughs> Congrats, Vicky. I'm telling you. I, I love her. I could just sit and look at her. She needs to be sitting next to my, next to the queen. Let's so, yeah. But those are the the special ones um, that I'm willing to let go, let go of now. I'm not quite there yet with some of the other ones. <laughs> like. Yeah, like the queen. I'm not. I'm not ready to let go of the queen. She is the queen. Do you want me to keep the queen here with me while you're in Florida? Or you take that one with you. Do I have to make that decision right now? I would assume. He asked me if I was going to take the queen with me when I went to Florida. No, I will tell you no, regardless. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you're excited. This purse is amazing. I think the intricacy in this, you know, everybody likes, what's the name of that other coach? The Rogue. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, I don't know. I, I, mm. no. No. yeah, the Rogue. Rogues are good. It's not as, yeah, it's right there. I'm telling you. Okay. What else do you guys want to see? You, you did say you're going to show that one over there. When I was up there. You, you guys want to see the Tory Birch? You said something about showing them something about that there earlier. Oh, I'm glad you're excited. So you want to get yeah, Vicky and I, uh, 6 p.m. Central, uh, 7 o'clock, Vicky time. <laughs> Forget, she's Pacific. Pacific. But she's doing a, a tote bag Tuesday. So I gotta pull some totes. Do I need to be on tomorrow? You wanna see the Tory? Huh? Do I need to be on tomorrow? <laughs> no, you don't have to. Okay. You don't have to do tote bag Tuesday. Hope they didn't see my butt. Well, they gotta oh. show if they did. Yeah. Oh, no, Sorry okay. guys, I didn't moon you. No, you're good. You're you're on camera view. <laughs> I hope I didn't move them. No, you're off camera view. You're fine. Okay. <laughs> Don't get no red flags. Okay. Oh, yeah. I didn't stuff her, but here she is. She's the accordion style. She's got the strap that can be moved and made a crossbody or a handbag. She doesn't have a back pocket though. She is bigger. I will measure her for you. There you go. And just want to know if you're doing clothing that's on clearance tomorrow. If I'm doing what? Clothing clearance. I can. I can even show if you want. I got a whole tote full there. Yeah, when it comes to the clothing, if, if um Tote bag Tuesday, it'll be tote bags. I don't want to infringe on... I'm going to go live with Vicky. I don't want to infringe on that. 
Um, but I do have a whole tote here. Everything's going to be 12 bucks. I don't care if it's pants, shoes, coats, um, t-shirts. There's some snarkadoodles in there, man. Um, I've got North Face. I've got Lacoste. I've got, you know, you guys have seen them before. Um, but I can, I can pop on and do that if you want to. It's not a big deal. There you go. Beautiful leather on the inside here. It's got a big old zipper pocket. There you go. Here's your Tory Burch. Let me get my fingers out of the way. Mm -hmm. All right. It's got another little pocket here. Pocket here. It's pristine. Pristine condition. Love it. Love it. Beautiful flap. So you just move the chain. There you go. You can have it as a crossbody. Or you can just double it up. And I will measure it for you. She's very lightweight. Actually, the chain is probably heavier than the bag itself. But it's very, very lightweight. And I love the accordion style because it can get quite large. She's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. So she is about eight and a half tall. Eleven and a half wide. And without stretching it, she's about three and a half. But she's a cordial style. She can go out to, to four, four and a half. She's beautiful. So, I didn't stuff her because I had her hanging up. Um, if you're interested in this one, I will do her for 85 She is perfect. Do you want to show that big green one over there? No. Okay. Be quiet, man. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, and what else do I have hanging up here? Yeah. You guys should see what I've done with the Alexander Wang that uh, Hadrian sent me. Yeah, he's like, do you want to show that tote bag? It is a Coach Rogue tote that I got from my bestie. And I told him to shit up. <laughs> no. <laughs> that is a J.W. Anderson bag. I'm going to smack him. <laughs> That's just like a total over again. <sighs> Seriously, man. I'm just trying to do good business. <laughs> and I can start the process. <laughs> Angela, if you want, if you guys want to see some clothing real quick, I'll show you. I've got one tote out here. I'll have to move them out in no purses. But I'll show you what I got packed in there so far. No, it's all stuff people have already seen. She doesn't like me doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, then. Jeremy, sweetie, will you will you pull over the the big black tote right there? Yeah. They want to see what I've I've pulled out so far. It's a big black tote. That's a normal size black tote to me. Uh huh. Well, to me, it's big, and oh, I've got man. it loaded. I'll show you what I've pulled so far. Some of it you've already seen. Over here, sweetheart, please. I'm sorry. You said over here for a second. So. Hi. 
Um, everything you need to know is in the description box down below. So you call out a number, there'll be a number, or there is an item um, that you like, you just call out mine. I don't do Cash App, but I do invoice via PayPal. Um, you don't need to have PayPal to be able, if you pay through the invoice, or I have Zelle. But I, I don't I don't know anything about Cash App, I don't use that. I do, but I'm not allowed to do it. Oh, Pauline Paris is calling the Green Kate Spade. Congratulations, Pauline. You'll definitely like that. It is amazing. Everybody look at Pauline's bag. It is beautiful. I only asked what I paid for with Adrian. Just sitting there. Okay, so I have some fun stuff. So I got some sweatshirts. This is a size large. Japanese Mickey. <laughs> the Japanese Mickey Mickey. Disney. <laughs> what else did I pull? I got a van sweatshirt. See some of these you guys have seen me wear, but I've gained a little weight. <clears throat> So they're a little tight in the belly. <laughs> so it's just, just the hands. And this is a size large. <laughs> it's got a front logo. Oh, wow. Huh? Did she? Yeah, just now got it. Oh, great girl, you're not playing. <laughs> All right. I have. She's secure. This is a size extra large, but it fits more like a large because. Cool tie dye. <laughs> Some fun stuff. Got it. Well, Jack Black, what is your deal? All right, I got oh, it's this one. This is a size large. You guys have seen me wear this before. <laughs> Which Jack Black? I don't know who Jack Black is. I know of a Jack, but I don't think it's the same one. No, I don't think so. I have... This is a size small, but it's a large small. This will fit more like a large. Say the word, but I'll take care of it. Yeah, there's some fun things in here. Uh, let's see. You guys don't want those. Those are my old work shirts. Nobody wants that crap. Okay. Oh. <laughs> nope. <laughs> now this is a size extra large. I don't know why it's in there. <laughs> Robin says why it's pink. Oh, this is cute. Robin, this is really cute. Okay. Robin wants a pink t-shirt. <laughs> Got it. So there's the noob. <laughs> I have... It's a beautiful... This is a size large. It's got, it's look guys, it's got a piece of Ziggy hair on it, so I'm sorry. MS called the band sweatshirt. Oh, MS did? Mm -hmm. Okay. Nope, not today. <laughs> this is a beautiful Calvin Klein 
And it's... <sighs> Ziggy Dog... Was Ziggy Dog messing around over there? It's got Ziggy Dog hair on it. I'll wash it and get Ziggy's hair off of it. Well, there was that one day he laid it. Oh! He likes to lay in baskets. And I didn't... I missed this. <sighs> so, I was... Ziggy Dog hair not included. This is a beautiful Calvin Klein jacket. Beautiful. It is a size large, so it's a tad too small for me, or I'd be keeping it. Because it is gorgeous. Ziggy Dog. Yeah, I'll cut with mine t shirt, not today. Oh, you want that one? <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> no t shirt. Now, that one is a little older. If you want the Nope t-shirt, it's going to cost, what is that, like $4.99 to ship it? Um, I will give you the Nope t-shirt for $5, okay? Because it's older. I mean, it's, yeah, see? Yeah, Gail, I don't feel right about charging you $12 for that t-shirt. It's old. But there you go. But you can have it for five because it's gonna cost like four something to ship. There you go. You're welcome, Gail. I mean, I'm not gonna do you like that. So there's that. Size large. Calvin Klein. What else do we have here? You guys have seen this one on me before. Now, this is a 2XL. Um, same thing. I mean, this is... Look. <laughs> you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say will be misquoted and then turned against you. <laughs> Used against you. <laughs> So this is a, actually it's a very small 2XL. I lounge around in it, so it fits more like a, a 1XL. So yeah. But again, this is same deal though. If anybody's interested in it, it's older. You could just say XL instead of 1XL. Yeah, well, it says 2XL, but you know. So it probably fits like an XL. Yeah. So you meant to say. So, if anybody's interested in that, I'll do $5 on it. I mean, it's not huge. It's not a big deal. Uh, you guys have seen me wear this. This is my Lacoste long sleeve. There you go. <laughs> Vintage look. Very nice. So this is this fits like uh, it fits like a, a an extra large. This in Lacoste land is a size seven. But it's in beautiful shape. It's long sleeve. I've worn it. So you can get Lacoste. Yeah, it's very vintage Lacoste, like late 80s, 90s Lacoste is cool. I have a, let's see, size large, but I'm telling you this would be more like a medium. I have a Patagonia pullover in black. Very nice. These run very small, so this says large. I'm telling you it's for a size medium person. Maybe even a small, because it's a large. And when I lost the weight and got into a large, I bought it, and it wasn't happening. So, so I never even got the chance to wear it, guys. So, Patagonia. And this one, I'm super bummed. I gained too much weight. It don't fit anymore. This is by... Uh, blind Rooster, it says extra large, but it fits like a large. Good vibes. 
Now this is the one that has the embroidery down the sleeves. This is a cool sweatshirt. And it's too tight for me. Ah, oh, it's gold. Now the embroidery goes down both sides. Sure. Don't mind the ziggy here. It's just a little quarter zip. Just a little tight on me. It does, you know, medium. We do better with this. The rooster is my landlord. Oh, the rocking, what did I say? Rocking rooster? Blind rooster. Yeah. Blind rooster? The good vibes. Mm -hmm. And look at that. <laughs> That's what you're all righty, Angela. Gotcha. <laughs> You're welcome. This is a cool sweatshirt. This really is. You're going to like that. You know, things happen right here, you know. <laughs> and the funny thing is, is I have a ton more. I have a closet full of coats, jackets. Uh, oh my God. I have a problem. <laughs> I have here. This fits me. Um, the only reason why I'm getting rid of this is Hollister, California, um, size large. Is I like it. It's fun. I like, you know, it gives me kind of, uh, you know, old school. 80s vibes, but in the neck area, it, 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 it yeah, this is cool, it's got the little thing on it, this is Hollister, beautiful, it fits me beautifully as an extra large, I just, with this particular hoodie, it's very substantial all around here, and it's just too much right here. And uh, it drives me insane. So it's a beautiful Hollister. There's nothing wrong with it. I just don't like how it feels around my neck. I'm weird like that. And could get uh, fast enough. I'm okay with t-shirts. And I'm okay with sweatshirts and that. When I wear hoodies, I tend to wear the thinner hoodies. This is very, this will be very warm. It's very thick, very substantial. And it was way too much on my neck. I was like freaking out a little bit. I, yeah. So I got it and I never wore it. So this is a North Face. It's a medium. Sandy, everything is $12. Where I'm doing, getting rid of, Everything. So, I have, I'll be showing the shoes. You guys have seen them all before. Um, even the coats that I've got hanging up. So, you want the Hollister? I'm trying to clear the closet out. It's absolutely yours. Sandy called the Hollister. Yeah, you're going to like this. It is so thick. It is. Thick, 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 thick. And I'm sorry about Ziggy now. I, I will wash everything again. They smell really nice, but Ziggy, he doesn't leave nothing alone. He's got to lay on everything. He's got to... <laughs> This is a North Face. Love it. I love the knit. It's very nice. This is North Face right there. There you go. So this is a size medium. It's a true medium. When I got down to a medium, I wore this. It's very soft. Love the knit material. 
love the granddad i i love those <laughs> so i got a bigger one this is a medium this is a medium Oh, Jennifer Yellow Horse calling this. Jennifer Yellow Horse? Yeah. Okay. Donald okay. asking about it. Jennifer was like, mine. <laughs> I have lots of lots of North Face guys. I think. Okay, I don't know if you guys remember this. This is a size large. It fits, but again, it's very substantial around the neckline. So, drives me nuts. But remember him? Da -da -da! <laughs> That's Paul. <laughs> So, still got her. Pretty and pink. Bones is mine. <laughs> I had a feeling she would get a kick out of that one. Yeah, you're going to like that. I, it's just... Yeah. The thick sweatshirts I can't deal with in my neck. So, that one is the kitty. I call it the spaghetti bowl. <laughs> pink spaghetti. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, what else I got in here? I have. What is this? This is a green label, uh, Ralph Lauren and Co. It is a size. I don't know. I would say it's a size large. If you can't figure it out, they usually have another tag down at the bottom. Usually. Ah! Look at you, man. Still don't say. It's very tight in the girly area for me. So, mm -hmm. I would say it's a size large. Large to an extra large. With this... Ah, darn Ziggy. It's got a packet there on the bottom. It is a green label. Nice pullover. Oh, I should have looked at these. Probably shouldn't have said anything. So you guys can see how the, you know. <laughs> the Ziggy hair. So that's a green label. All right. I got a couple more things in this tote. And that's as far as I got. I have an Oakley sweatshirt here. It's a size... This one is a small. It just says Oakley down the side. So it's just a plain back sweatshirt, black sweatshirt, just says Oakley. Right there. I think I got this with a pair of sunnies, some kind of giveaway or whatever. Never been able to wear it because it's a small. So. <laughs> but I think it's a men's small, so a woman's medium would be able to wear it. Let's see. I have my other short sleeve. I have my other Lacoste shirt. It's just your standard. Just your standard, what you call it, with the... Yeah, yeah, I forget. So, dark gray. It is in Lacoste land. It's size 7. So, that'd be a large, extra large. Lacoste short sleeve. And then, my Mickey Mouse Club. This one is size large. Disney Parks. This is a stress look. Er, Mickey Mouse. Very cute. 
Polo, thank you. Yeah. It completely eluded me for a minute. <laughs> there you go. So it's at Disney Parks. And it's, you know, too tight. See, I can't go any any much more thicker than this. This is not not too, you know, too heavy. If I go any bigger than that, you know, I feel like I'm being strangled. So Disney Parks. And then I do have a beautiful North Face. I think I showed this to you guys one time before. It is a size large. It does fit me, but it fits me a little too form fitting. And I know it's stretchy and what have you. So if you're a medium or a, a large to an extra large, um, this will fit you beautifully. It's a beautiful North Face. Love the green. It's got something going on right there. I don't know what that logo means. It does say North Face in the back. It's a hoodie. There you go. This was not a cheap thing. Summit Series. There you go. Size large. Huh? Oh, it's the Summit Series. So, nice, lightweight. Now, this would be perfect for you guys out in California and all that on those nights where it's a little chillier. It's very soft on the inside. Linda, are you calling this? You're going to love this. It's a Summit Series. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love it. But, you know, I can't stay away from the Twinkies. <laughs> so, that's what you're from. Yeah. So there you go. That's your first North Face, really? Wow. I have a lot. A lot. A lot, a lot. So let me know, guys, you know, if the Ziggy Dog hair doesn't bother you or if it does. And I'll run them through the wash again and I'll make them stay outside by packaging. If that dog, my Ziggy, I don't know what it is. You can brush him, you can do whatever, and he just, meh, or everything. So that's all that's in that tote. And I have an entire closet full of Oh, okay. <laughs> Good. Uh, of jackets, and, you know, I have a lot of the Columbia jackets and and all that in all sizes. So, I just have a lot. And I don't even wear a fraction of what I have. So... Were you interested in the Patagonia? Linda? I mean, she looked at it, but I was Okay. That might just show up in her bag. <laughs> and some tie-dye. You have two Bostons? Oh. You guys, I was on vacation and I missed dog treat and cat treat day. And then I decided to, and then with my rotation, I, have, I haven't got any dog food or cat treats in probably a month. So, because usually I'll send Don Hill some cat treats and stuff like that, and I can't. Harley? Oh. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I, I wouldn't get rid of it, but it's, I have Harley Davidson. Do I have Harley Davidson? I have Harley Davidson. I don't have Harley Davidson. That's usually Road Runner. Are you looking for Harley, like, jackets or full on coats? I 
No, unless you meant the same. Where did I hang those up? I did have hardly like four. If they're not in your closet, they're there in my office. In that closet. Your dog's got new collars today? Ah. Uh, my dog got her anal gland squeezed today. <laughs> Poor Matilda. Hey, let me check. I might have. You want me to check for I have some beautiful Harley gear. Here, let me check for you. Okay. I can actually Jeremy's going to go check. Because I can actually get back there. And if I have any more North Face and the other one, jackets pull out. So I got some nice North. I got some nice jackets, and they might want to get those for 12 bucks. Sweatshirts, jackets, etc. Okay. North Face. They're interested in North Face or Harley Davidson. I have a leather jacket. Um, I bet you they're still down at the. I wonder if I didn't forget those and leave those behind. Are you sure I didn't leave those behind? Because they were in the front closet at the other house. So. Yeah, so if I didn't, I will make sure. I have an insane amount of Harley gear. Um, I've got those spring jackets. I have the leather jackets. I have the jackets with body armor. I have it all. Um, I don't think they're here. You don't have them in that car. I'll check the other one. I don't think they're not hanging in there. Yeah, but not the Harley. So. I will um, get my Harley gear back. So. Because I'm not going to let his ugly ass troll of a girlfriend wear my Harley gear. So I will get that back. And then I will offer it to you guys at absolute steals. It is, <clears throat> today it was 30 degrees, but the last couple of weeks we got the snowstorms and the ice, it was negative three. And now it's raining, so it's supposed to get down to 10 degrees, so it's going to be a nightmare in the morning. Yeah, it's pretty bad. Nice. I'm going to. But after what I just said, 50 bucks says I don't get it. But I'll make sure my lawyer has it on the list. You have no more North Face in either of these closets. Actually. You do have a bunch of Columbians, though. No North Face? You know what? Check the totes behind my door. Because Kendall did pack some things. I doubt he packed my Harley gear, but... Ham's chicken. There was a couple totes that were packed for me, and, but I haven't looked through them yet. I'm not seeing any Harley, but I see all the stuff that's in here. You want me to bring them out here? Yeah. Oh, I love you guys too, but I, I'll I'll send a message tomorrow. I need I want the 
at least the coats i have there was one i don't know if you guys remember the airbrush edition it it, it i have the full body armor it's like a woven um i have the jackets that have the embroidery i have um leather coat i have one with that has body armor it's not leather but it's like the woven and it was the white uh with the turquoise it was the limited edition it was like an airbrush design on the back i have that one i have a black neoprene like one with the body armor um that has embroidered logos That's stuff that's just been put there. Oh. Here's your womanly trench. Oh, that's a strip you don't want to show on there. Okay, I'm just take the lid off and just put this. Yeah. I'm trying to do it not so noisy. He's trying. <laughs> Try not to be noisy, he says. Pink. I'll see more face when we throw it at you. Um, do you want to trade spots? I could do that quicker. If you want to. He's going to come say hi to you. I'm going to look. I don't look at the grass. He can't say hi. Huh? I don't look at the grass. I can't say hi. Oh, he won't say hi because he doesn't look the greatest, he says. They, they don't care. You can pop over and say hello. Hello, everyone. Oh, no. I have, well, the the Milwaukee heater coat is there. Yeah. That's a Milwaukee. Uh, don't mind the shirt. I did this uh, when I was doing maintenance in an apartment complex a while ago. So it's all bleached up. I like wearing it because it's, it's one of those shirts that are thermal, so it's great for the winter. Hello, Angela. Hello, Donna. Hello, Gail. Yep. Yeah, I, I think the old Turdsky kept your leather stuff. Now, that bottom one was your dirty clothes basket in your room for the longest time. <laughs> So I don't think you want to show any of that. Yeah, he kept the leather stuff. Huh, I wonder why. All right. I appreciate that, Don. Yeah, I know, right, Dee Dee? Uh, Mom said pajama day or pajama party, so I was like, I'll do it too, why not? I got me some super long icy PJs. But yeah, uh, and back to Dawn, uh, I've been told otherwise quite a bit by old friends that are not friends anymore. So, obviously, I like to keep telling them, I'm like, I raise them how I want to raise them. That's right, Dawn. PJs. PJs for life. Hmm. I don't have any other clothing well it's not as dirty as in how I make it sound it's dirty because it's like covered in dog hair so it's just stuff that's been sitting around collecting dust and dog hair 
That's what I meant by dirty. Now, if I would have said dirty, like, dirty, dirty clothes, I'd have been like, they stink. <laughs> but they don't stink. <laughs> and, um, she would always, with the, with the PJs, yeah. She, uh, she's always bugged me because I never had my PJs before I moved in here. Here's a North Face. Size small. That is a, that is a North Face? Yep, that's a North Face. Okay. It didn't look like a North Face to me, but then again, I literally couldn't reach it. Oh, that's in that closet. Uh, I don't know. I've had them for a long time. I don't know where I got them at. To be honest with you. Well, yeah, I mean... I'm, I'm going to say once I had Brian and right after I had the stroke, I I decided to uh, grow up because <laughs> I was an immature kid, even an adult man's body working at a factory. And so once everything uh, opened up in my head, because uh, I... I've told everybody this, like, the, I, I feel like the only reason why I survived my stroke was because of my son. So. What? Uh, what do you mean by commando guy? Because that could be two different things here. You gotta be careful what you say there. Because <laughs> I guarantee you, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Okay. Let me move this. Nope, he kept the Harley gear, guys. Yeah, well, of course he did. Yeah. Well, Angela, to tell you, I live with my mom. I'm not doing that when she's here. <laughs> Let alone she's not here, because who knows? She might walk in one day and be like, what the heck? And she <laughs> might smack the heck out of me, too. <laughs> Tell them you doing command doing your house. What the heck? What? Yeah, I said, you smack, I said you smack the hell out of me if I did that. What? Yeah. Do I even want to know? Talk about going commando. <laughs> That's all Angela was doing. <laughs> oh, commando guy. No, I don't do that at your house. <laughs> this is your place, not my place. If that was my own place, three different story. <laughs> another north face but this is a this is a size small it might fit a medium i'm not sure no i've never worn it that won't fit a medium yeah that is a standard now that's a standard small thank you jeremy for that input on the ladies wear <laughs> i'm just saying <laughs> so this is a north face so it's got the little things for the elf that's cute. That's cute. Good. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, my uh, my Harley gear is not here. None of it. It's a good thing you took your leather bag back. I've been here for almost a year now and didn't even notice I didn't have it. You probably gave, <laughs> you probably gave his, your old Harley gear to. No. I will um, send a message tomorrow saying that I will be dropping by to get it all. Or he can bring it here. I'm, there's not going to be a choice given. So I will have that for you guys <laughs> by the next sale. Yeah, really. So, yeah. It better not be being used. It better not be. I guarantee you all that crud. The two of undercover leather. <laughs> Is there anything else you guys want to see? I've kept you online here for about three hours. 
And now you can't even watch in my living room now because I just tore apart all those totes. <laughs> Let me write that down too. I messed up Kendall. If you forget to do it tomorrow, I'll say something to him. If you want me to. Mm -hmm. Well, he's going to give it to me tomorrow. I know. If you forget to do it, I'll do it. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Yeah, I think for one of his coats, I paid $500 for one of his coats. Yeah. I have some expensive things. My mother came with five hundred dollars. But no one wants to wear that it's a four XL jacket. That's heavy as crap. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay guys. I'm getting a little tired. Hey Veronica. But yeah, I will I will get the Harley jackets. So as soon as I get those, I'll show them to you. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you, everybody. And I will see you tomorrow for the Tote Tuesday with Purse Curator. So, good night, everybody. Love you. Think good thoughts. <laughs> Sleep well. Bye.